Hello everyone, this is Easter Wolf with Gotta Start Somewhere, it is Hinon1032. Uh, continuing in just doors. Our, uh, good old saint searching here. I didn't find anything. I'm still up to 8 Astral Pearls a turn, but I guess a fair bit of that is from Marverni. Their capital gives 4, so... That's the best saint searching you can do, is if you just, you know, go kill your enemies. Hmm, okay. So, uh, yeah, it's all looking quite fine. Light Evocation 5 pretty easily this turn. Uh, we got some to see here. here. Get a couple of the Dawn Guard going. I'm gonna have this guy start moving back out. I'm going to forge one more pair of Earth Boots with this guy. Do I. And I do have another Dwarven Hammer in addition to that. So I'll go and forge another pair of Earth Boots. Because they're just pretty useful to have around. And um, this is of course unless I... Okay, come on, I need the Earth Metal card so I can make Bloodstones. Come on. Should see. Go ahead and get those off of him. Uh, remember that I need to recruit mages first. Very important thing. Uh, so I think I just want to send my bales in and just have them both spamming Earthquake. Uh, since I've got two Earth ones, you know, lucky for me. So having them do that, and then, so it's just an Earth 3 spell, right? Or 4, okay. That still means that each additional one of these can do summon earth power and then use one additional gem to do that. How much health did I have? 23. Versus the 66 here. That's the problem. The earthquake's going to do damage to my guys, too. So... Unless they've got winged boots, I suppose. Okay, start blood hunting there. Have another one go out and blood hunt here, I suppose. Uh, you can just go ahead and patrol a bit. Eventually, I want to get labs up here, but until then, I may as well just go ahead and uh, do other things. There we go. So that's not looking the best. I mean, I, I want to get Earthquake at all time. I want to see if I want to go to six, though. Not terribly much. I think I'll want to start working on enchantment instead. Okay, and this is a defense check. So these guys should be fine. Oh man, it's such a risky thing. Such, such a risky thing if to uh, just send out two giant mages like this to go and try and wipe those guys out. Hmm. It's an interesting thing. Okay. Whatever was running with you. This guy is, no, okay, no, he's not. He's just he's not doing that badly. Okay, what spells can a fire a milk card to cast that might be useful for these kind of things? A little wisp. Will o Wisp is actually pretty damn good. Um, and it's more of something that you have small mages spam, though, in my opinion. Uh, although the Malachar is not exactly a huge fire mage, so. Hmm. Is there anything? Earthquake's going to make it impossible for me to reinvigorate afterwards, because those slaves are certainly going to be dead by the time I'm done. And my guys do need some kind of guard around them in order to, uh... In order to just alleviate fire and that kind of thing. The Dawn Guard will work pretty well at that. As well as say yeah, actually. They won't do too badly. Now, if I had one of these guys out there casting, uh, well, Earth Power, of course, 
But then you could iron skin himself, and then iron warriors on the seer. And that could work. So what else is we have them just starting to set up the script, I guess. Uh, yeah, that's a pretty good one to keep. I'll keep that. We'll start assigning that to six as the start of my uh, the, the start of my scripting. And blood hunting is going on here, all right. Getting really high on the unrest. Maybe I should work that down a little bit and give this guy a bunch to uh, patrol with. So he can do that pretty well. Keep searching. I'll go ahead and put 10 here just to dissuade villains from just taking my province from me. I'll go ahead and put 10 here as well. Because I do not want to lose my magic sites. To just random bullshit, which I have misfortune, so it's gonna it's not exactly random, it will happen. It's kinda going through. Okay. Well, the rest of this isn't looking too bad. Blood hunting over here, what kind of spells can we cast? Well we can summon some imps to start, because that's always a good thing to do. Hmm. That wouldn't be bad, just spam some agony on them. And then reinvigoration. That should work out fairly well for him. I'm trying to think if I want to have one of these guys. Is there any. I don't have fire shield or anything like that. No. So I think the Astral Mail card's probably better with Body of Thrail. You'd be able to do that pretty well. I guess the first thing we do it would be probably blessing and then body trail. Personal luck. Something like that should work out alright. And then he should be able to just attack the back. Something like that. Okay, let's give him some equipment and send him on out. Dawn armor is pretty good, so we'll just go ahead and keep that. Uh, I should probably forge him up some kind of a weapon. Well, no, he's got a magic weapon already. It's pretty damn good. So he might just wind up keeping that. We can shoot this in. I mean, there are certainly things that I could. In fact, I think I might. I only want to send in two pairs of earth boots. So we'll go ahead and keep that. Make a girdle of might for him. And what else? I want to keep his re uh, reinvigoration pretty high. Uh, we'll eventually turn him there. Still not bad though, that's limited regen. But we could also just give him a ring of regen, so I think I might just do that. Um, and I'm getting four of these nature gems a month, so I may as well spend them. Right? I got my... let's make another when you boot. And unless I'm just forgetting... Yeah, let's have these guys actually move so they stop clogging up my uh, menu. Should be going and taking a look at Abyssia, who I think killed Yumi. Looks like Saramatia is not doing too good. Okay. I didn't see any storm demons, so that's a good thing. I'm gonna try and attack this province and see if uh, it's 
these are just the soldiers that randomly routed or something. Hmm. I can also have the mill carts uh, go and just ravage the countryside as well. Is another option. If they've got flying boots and that kind of thing, they can just uh, kind of rove around, raid provinces for me. I still think maybe making a ring of tamed lightning would not be a bad idea either, though. And then again, that does even better, and it costs, yeah, it, it's only bonuses compared, so I'll go ahead and make one of those. And I'm now getting one a month, one entire gem a month. Okay. I'll summon some fire drinks, just to start using my fire gems for something. And we'll be able to start getting flame spirits soon if I wanted to. They're not too bad. They auto-summon auto will-o-wisps at the start of the battle, which immediately go in and disrupt scripting. Fire snakes are also not bad. Certainly things to think about. Okay, I think that's what we're doing for this turn. And then pretty soon I'm going to head out. I'll probably have the Prophet with him and he can bless everyone. Uh, just because Reinvigoration 3 is actually a pretty decent bless. At least for the casters and that kind of thing. My goodness, they're just ravaging. Hey, Kalasa seems to be making some kind of a comeback. Works for me. I'd rather have to deal with them than Lanka. Yeah, it's not looking too bad. Oh, can you, uh, can you take the Serene with you? Excellent. Let me just get some more of those demons out there. And what will it take? Thunder Ward. Yeah. It takes level 5 research, and I'm not waiting for level 5 in another field. So that's what we'll call turn 32. See you next time.